cartoon characters hawking processed junk, fast food chains pushing cheap eats, and big food manufacturers zeroing in on salty, crunchy, and sugary foods aimed at young taste buds. Sometimes it's fantastic that America's kids ever read a square meal. Our children are facing nutrition-related health threats like never before. Parents, teachers, and advocates all understand the challenge, but several vital efforts are to turn things around. Let's see some research. Growth from 2001 to 2017 in the number of Americans under age 20 living with type 2 diabetes was once considered an adult onset disease. At the same time, the number of people under age 20 diagnosed with type 1 diabetes increased by 45%, according to a 2021 report in JAMA. The proportion of American kids' calories that come from ultra-processed foods, like frozen pizza and hamburgers, microwavable meals and packaged snacks and sweets, according to a nationwide study published in 2021 in JAMA that analyzed the diets of 33795 youths ages 2 to 19. The proportion of kids ages 2 to 19, classified as obese as of 2017 to 2018, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. That trend is especially prominent among kids ages 2 to 5. In today's world, it is more important than ever for children to have a strong foundation in nutrition. This video will teach you how to fortify your kids' diets and help them stay healthy. By following the tips, in this video, you can help your child to get the nutrients they need for a strong body and mind. Nutritious School Lunches When it comes to fortifying kids' nutrition, one of the most important ways to do so is through nutritious school lunches. A well-balanced meal that includes all the necessary nutrients can help ensure that kids are getting the energy they need, along with the vitamins and minerals they need for optimal development. School lunches are an important part of a child's diet and can help fortify them with vitamins, minerals, and other nutrients. However, they can also be unhealthful if they're not properly fortified. Here are some tips for fortifying kids' nutrition in school lunches. 1. Choose nutrient-rich foods. The best way to fortify kids' nutrition in school lunches is to choose foods that are high in nutrients. This means choosing fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins. 2. Add vitamins and minerals. If the food choices you make don't provide enough nutrients, add vitamins and minerals to the lunch box yourself. This can be done by adding supplements or by mixing premixed vitamin and mineral drinks into the food. 3. Avoid unhealthy snacks and drinks. Avoid giving your child sugary snacks and drinks in place of meals. These snacks will only add on extra weight and calories instead of helping them to stay healthy. Many school districts have switched to providing free or reduced price lunches for students, but many parents are unaware of the importance of choosing nutritious foods for their children. While it is important that all students receive a good education, it is also important to provide them with healthy meals, nutrition, and tasty education programs. The importance of nutrition education as a means for improving nutrition of the community in the developing countries has increased rapidly during the recent past. Lack of awareness about the dietary requirements and nutritive value of different food is the main cause for prevailing malnutrition among school children, pregnant women, lactating mother, and other vulnerable sections of the community. Nutrition education should be practical and should be easily adaptable to the socioeconomic status food habits, and the available local food resources generally needed for the purpose of demonstration and feeding of the locally available audience. Nutrition education programs should become a part of the community. It is important to expose children to healthy foods in a positive way. Creating habits and behaviors at this age is the most important part. Healthy eating model. Eating well at home can help shape a kid's long-term relationship with food. There have been dozens of studies showing that regular family dinners are great for children's bodies, minds, spirits, and mental health. Make sure you demonstrate healthy eating habits by including plenty of vegetables, fruits, and whole grains in your diet. More time at home can result in less stress and more enjoyment surrounding meal planning and preparation and create a more pleasant mealtime atmosphere for you and your child. With many of us spending more time at home, now is an excellent time to role model healthy eating and involve your kids in meal planning and preparation. 
The following are tips for setting a good example for healthy eating and promoting a healthy lifestyle for your child. Like, try to maintain structured meal and snack times. Snacking throughout the day and filling up on unhealthy foods can lead to poorly eaten meals. Plan meals for at least one week. This will ensure you have the proper ingredients on hand when you start meal preparation and may help you to limit your time in the grocery store. Involve your child in meal planning and preparation and remember to have fun in the kitchen. Preparing foods together and combining exciting shapes, colors, and flavors can result in greater food acceptance. Eat together as a family. With kids involved in fewer activities, try to eat together as a family and avoid mealtime distractions. Encourage physical activity and make it a fun, family time. When children are physically active, they build up an appetite for meals and may be more motivated to eat well and try new foods. Children's diets should consist of a variety of healthy foods to ensure optimal health. A healthy diet for children should include plenty of fruits and vegetables, whole grains, low-fat dairy products, and lean protein. It is important to keep track of your own health and make small tweaks to your lifestyle to help ensure that you are on the path to optimal health. So guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope this video will help you the most. Stay healthy and stay with Health Conscious.